folks, Fat Guy Flies RC. We're out here at the Avon Park here at our Models Club. We're gonna take up uh, the E-Flight 90 Viper and the Zeus, Freewing Zeus 90 millimeter. And I'm gonna run them both on the exact same, not the exact same, but they're gonna have the same battery install, a 5006 uh, 5006S with a 50C HRB. These are both brand new batteries. And uh, we're gonna just kind of fly them in the same manner. They each have KM models afterburners that I've installed. They each have thrust reverse. They each are 90 millimeter, each run on 6S. Um, Viper, of course, costs about 100 bucks more. Um, and it has a little bit wider of a wingspan. But I did the Maiden on Zeus a while ago, and it flies very similar, at least lands very similar to the Viper. And both of them have a very, really good locked-in feel. So anyways just got them here side by side you can kind of see the comparison I'll leave the battery i'm going to use all right motor on do you love that afterburner okay i'm gonna take her out here Gonna center line to take off flaps. Here we go. Well, you can really see that afterburner. Kind of going to a lower light situation right now. So, running in my high range, which are 100 cent throws, over 30% expo. That's the way I like to roll. Come by kind of slow. We're gonna take her up. One, two, three. All right. Landing flaps. I kill my airspeed a little bit. Got my flaps down. He lined up my center line. Watch that cross freeze. Breaking. Three minutes. All right. Breaks off. All right, we're gonna turn around. All right, no takeoff flaps this time. Here we go. Gear up. We're gonna come back over here and go up on the other side. Going up in one, two, three. Come by full speed. Oh man. Gear down. Landing flaps. Love that howl. All right, we're going to come by down the runway kind of low and slow. Make sure my gear is down, all my goodies are working. Killing some air speed. We're not landing this time. We're just going to fly by. Coming right at us. Yep, everything looks good. Turn, turn back towards the road. Do need to work a little bit of down elevator mix. She definitely wants to rise on me an awful lot with the balloon just a little bit with that gear down or with the uh, flaps all the way down. I don't know, I might leave it alone. It's manageable. You lined up the runway, turn back towards the runway. Breaking. All right, we're going to take off from down there. Up. Breaks off. Here we go. Beautiful, beautiful, beautiful. Gear up. 
come back towards us. Gonna come right at us and show the belly. All right. Gear down. Put my gear now. One minute landing flaps. All right. Line up for my final approach. Kill my airspeed. Start turning towards the runway. Kill my airspeed. Get my wings level. Letting that cross breeze slow me down. Now turn towards the runway. Braking. And braking. That braking is saving your retracks. You hit that rough stuff down there, you're just taking life off them retracks. All right, you know what? We got 35 seconds. I'm going to push it. Flaps up. Do one more. Just a quick up and down, not even going to take the gear up. Landing flaps. 20 seconds. All right, turn back towards the runway. Letting that cross sprint kill my speed. Be ready for the cross breeze to turn the wing over. Okay. Braking. Ten, nine, eight. Brakes off. Seven. Man, I love this jet. All right, we just got home from work. Breaking. Got a, and we got to uh, park the car in the garage. Gonna back in. Oh, <laughs> well, I just pushed both my uh, ventral fans off. <laughs> Prop secured. Let's, uh, this is not a smart battery that's in here, so I can't check it on the, through this. I don't think I can. I'll make sure. Sometimes I can. Depends on the battery. I mean, smart batteries, yes. All right, gotta undo the afterburner. Flew for five seconds shy of four minutes. So three minutes and 55 seconds. 27%, perfect. Perfect storage rate. All right, put my checker back on my transmitter. Okay, let's put her back together. Them fans, these central fans, uh, or dorsal fans, they just are, are, are not, not dorsal, they're, um, I don't know what they're called. Fans. They they've got their hard plastic on the on the bottom half that touches the ground. Just a nice touch. Help protect that bottom. The folks right there. One of the best jets I've ever flown in my life. And Zeus, you might be a close contender so far, but tell you what, E Flight, everybody knows it. It's a winner. Folks, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. God bless y'all. And don't forget, faith, family, and friends. And then Jets and KM Models, thank you for the afterburner. Bye-bye. Folks, we're going to continue on with our comparison flight of the 90mm uh, Vazus versus the E-Flight Viper 90mm. Right, left, up, down, right, left. High rates, 100%. Here we go. Let me get turned around here. Love that afterburner. Hope we got enough light I can see. Definitely see the uh, lights on the plane for sure. Okay, here we go. Gear up. Landing flaps.
Man, what a sweet flying jet. Time remaining, three minutes. Flaps up. Gear down. Landing flaps. All right, we're gonna have to land because I can't see her that well. I'm gonna go around enough we land. Actually, we're gonna go out here. And I'm gonna land from this direction. If they end up in the grass, that's okay. Braking. Brakes off. Yeah. Folks, I'd like to continue the flight and the battery, but the light is getting so bad that I can't, I'm starting to have a hard time even with them lights. So, so we're going to have to call it quits just for the safety of, of others and the plane. Yeah. All right. Let's go ahead and. But this is the second time I've ever flown her, and I got to tell you, absolutely phenomenal plane. Phenomenal plane. Flaps up. All right. Still had a, almost two minutes left to go, but like I say, it's getting too dark for me to see safely see the plane. And last thing I want to do is lose control of this plane and it go into someone's windshield and kill somebody. Yeah, I don't want to live with that. So, 71%. Yeah, I definitely could fly three or four, at least another two minutes, but. All right, folks, well, that's going to be it for now. This is the Free Wing Zeus. Um, great, let me get a hold of it. Great flying plane. Um, if you can handle the price and handle the price of the batteries, she flies a lot like the Avanti 2 and the 70 millimeter Vulcan. If those two got together and had a big baby, that's this. That's the Zeus. All right, folks, thank you for watching. Don't forget to like and subscribe. God bless y'all, and don't forget, faith, family, and friends, and Zeus!